Hi guys, just thought we'd take a quick look at this uh, budget headlight from um, Decathlon. Uh, picked it up the other day, um, charged it as you can see, not had it out of the box yet. So yeah, come out to the woods today. Um, it's dusk at the minute, uh, I think it's around about 6, 6.30, so we're not far off dark now. Um, but yeah, uh, 9.99 from Decathlon. Uh, it's USB, uh, the Trek 100, uh, 120 looms. So yeah, um, what else we got? We've got three modes. We've got a low white light, then a high white light, and then a red, which is quite handy. Um, it's an I IPX4. I don't know if anyone, if you can see that, if it will focus. So yeah, it gives you some sort of idea and the sort of I think the range, the light beam, is around about uh, 25 meters. You know, it's not huge, but you know, it's got to be uh, expected for something that costs sort of 10 pounds. Um, looking in the shop, and I think the burn time on this was 17 hours. I could be wrong on that, but I presume that's on low low light, not on the high beam. But uh, I thought I'd give it a go. So let's have a quick look. Uh, you know Decathlon they seem to be making quite decent stuff these days from all the reviews that I've looked at um, not really a lot in it it does come with a micro USB cable but I did take that out to charge it up before I come out uh, just so we sort of get a good effect of it but there's, there's very little on there but yeah so headband um, all oh, right um, not adjustable which is a little bit disappointing actually um, even on cheap a lot cheaper head torches than this you sort of still get the uh, adjustable head you know that you can tilt backwards and forwards as you want it um, headband yeah, seems decent quality uh, adjustable so it'll fit any size nut hopefully um so all right so yeah pull it out like that so let's have a look that's the first one quite good second is the low It's a little bit darker. I don't think we'll have to wait too much longer. But yeah, it's not a bad little thing, like say for a tenner. Um, just sling it in the backpack, don't you? Uh, you don't worry too much about it. You know, you, you kind of, uh, you come out to the woods and I know I've done it, you lose stuff. So uh, sometimes you kind of think, you know, is it worth spending sort of uh, you know, sort of 50, 60, 70 pounds on a Petzl. Uh, they are good, I suppose. I've never had one myself. Um, but this is my first USB. Uh, and that's what I liked about it. That's what I wanted, a uh, USB. Um, because I, I've got um, a power bank, an anchor power bank, you know, like I say, just throw it in the backpack with this. You never have to worry about batteries or anything like that anymore. So what we'll do, um, like I say, I'll try and get a bit of footage in the woods uh, tonight. Uh, hopefully it won't take too much longer before we we're quite dark. And then we'll be able to sort of have a better idea of what it looks like. So, I'll catch you later guys. 